off of. We got some white bass right out in front of me here that just came up. Let's see if I can catch one. Oh no, I ain't gonna catch one like that. I ain't gonna catch one like that. Pull your bell back here. Try it again. There we go. Well, they just came up. There's one. There he is right there. Oh my God, got him. Big old school white bass. Just came up right here. Out of nowhere, man. Just a tearing it up here. I was down there trying to catch a little bluegill. Look at this big old white bass here. Big old white bass. Big old. I may keep a couple of these right here for bait. Sometimes you let it fall down. I'm gonna let it drop. Mississippi one, Mississippi two, Mississippi three, Mississippi four. Kind of pick it up right there. There we go. Got him that time. Yeah, let it drop down a little bit sometimes, folks, and that's the key. They'll come up, be busting the top of the water, but when they go back down, they'll be a little bit deeper. We got another one right here, decent one. Keep them out of them weeds there a little bit. Look at him run right there, people. Man, that's a hard fighting fish on this eight pound test. Good ones out here, boy, look at it. Yeah, I'm gonna keep a couple of these for the freezer here. See if I can't have me a little white bass dinner here. Sometime in the not too distant future. They throw it out there. Yeah, they're still out there. Mississippi one, Mississippi two, Mississippi three. There's one right there. I didn't even have to dang. Really, just let it fall. He nailed it, man. They're stacked up out there. Look at them busting it out there. Dang it, I wish Harold would have stuck around a little bit. You missed them, Harold. You missed them, my friend. You should have hung around another 45 minutes. We got them stacked up out here. It's my buddy Harold loves to catch these white bass. Uh oh. Yeah. He's gone. Quick release on a white bass. Go ahead there, little buddy. There you go. You're all right. Let's see if we can get another one. Throw it out there. Let it fall. These things are so much fun to catch. First time that I've really got into these white bass for a while here. It's good to see. Finally getting them coming in here a little bit. Let it sink down there a little bit. Uh oh, there was one. There he is. Got him. Got him that time. Out here, act a little bit more like a largemouth, maybe. Kind of come up and pop the top of that water. I got my catfish rods in the way down here a little bit. And they thought, look at that, people. I mean, that is a fighting fish right there. That's a nice one right there. Really nice one. That's three for the freezer. I have me a little white bass dinner here for a while. Wish I had me a cooler to put them in. We ain't got too much light here before dark. This one kind of swallowed it down. God, there they come again, folks. Good God, look at them all out there. I had to break off and retie right here. Look at them. This is what it's all about. Look at that white bass action they are just stacked up out there stacked up my friends I got a retire right here had one swallow it down and had to do a little surgery to get it out of there we got us three white bass here there we go good knot let's get back out there and get another one folks 
while the action is going good. Make sure we got a, here we go. All right, here we go. There we go, here we go. Let it sink down a second. Pick it up. I didn't really get that cast out there that far. GoPro stopped recording. Sink down a little bit. There he is, got him that time. Well, let's see what we got. I don't feel all that big all of a sudden. Hard to tell. Am I recording? Yeah, we're recording. Yeah, might be fairly decent size. He's trying to get in those weeds right there. Sure fire hard. They're still out there. I think this is number five here. Look at that. Man. He's a little smaller. I think I'll hang on to him as well. Oh, we got one here at Dar. Can't tell how big it is though. Pretty good sized fish, I think. Feels like a decent sized fish. Here I go saying decent again. Let me get this camera pointed up a little bit. Got a little weight to it. Hadn't come up yet, so I don't think it's a bass. I'm anxious to see what we got right here. It's coming in pretty quick right here now. We're gonna get a chance to see what we got. Yeah, that's a, that's a good fish, I do believe, right here. Better give him a chance to back reel a little bit. Yeah, that's a, that's a good fish. Let's see what we got. Don't want to lose him right here. I think it's a big channel, maybe. I think it's a big channel, folks. Yeah. Big old yellow channel cat. Big old channel, boy. A lot of times when big channel cats will get kind of, kind of dark. And with color, but this one's got a nice, uh, yellow color to him here he's hooked up good I can just get down here and get him let's see if I can grab him right here it's kind of tough to get down here on these slimy rocks Got him. Little channel cat. Grab my pliers and get him turned loose. Alright, my little buddies get back in there. My little booze was trying to get out on me. Grab these pliers. But that is a good channel catfish, folks. That is way bigger than you'd normally catch around here. Pretty sure that's a pure channel cat. They do have hybrids, believe it or not, between the channel and the blue. Gotta be careful over here. Alright. 
Oh boy, strong fighting fish here. Figured he was gonna do that, but we just slammed right in to that camera right there. Miraculously, didn't get a bunch of juice on it. Now this size here is just a little bit big to be handling with one hand like this. We're going to try it here. Right at dark, Mr. Channel Cat going back. Heck of a fight and fish. Okay, let's get him to go back. You ready to go back? Here he goes. Mr. Channel Cat. There he goes. <laughs> 